Thanks for joining me for this introduction to searching in Galileo. To Galileo through D2L. Two different places. From your D2L home screen, if you scroll all the way down, you have Galileo Discover search box right here. So you can select classic search, you can select advanced search, will take you into the Galileo page and you can start your search here. You can also, if you're in a class in D2L, the, under the library tab, you've got access to the library's homepage and also Galileo. So this will take you to that Galileo homepage. From the library's homepage, it's under research tools or in the search box right here. So research tools, Galileo, and we're all going to the same place. This search here is called the Discover Search. It searches um, a dozens of databases all at once. So you, depending on what you put in, you could get hundreds, thousands, even over a million results. So don't be overwhelmed by that. The more words that you add to your search, the narrower it will get. So let's do a quick search here. study habits. I'm going to click on search. There is this how to use this page option that will help you um, if you forget this information. So here's our search results for study habits and we've got over 4 million results which is a lot. Um, for basic terms sometimes you'll get this research starter which is like uh, background information. This comes from the Salem Press Encyclopedia so that can give you some basic information about study skills in this case. And then if you scroll down, you can see the different types of resources that you have access to. You've got academic journals, magazines, ebooks, newspapers, reviews, dissertations, um, actual physical books, just all sorts of things. The vast majority are going to be in academic journals. So if you want to limit your search to one particular type of resource, you can click it here or you can click it here. So let's say I've been asked to find information on study habits of college students in the United States. So that's adding some words. So I'm actually going to go to the advanced search. And I'm going to put quotation marks around study habits because that's a phrase. And I want that to be searched together. So study habits, call it, oops, <laughs> I can't type, students, United States. I've got quotation marks around all of them because it's more than one word that I'm searching, but I want to search it as a phrase. So I'm going to go ahead and click search, and this brings us back about 8,000 results. So that's really different. Um, we're still looking at all sorts of different types of resources and all dates. So I'm going to click full text so that I can see the articles I can access here within Galileo. I'm going to select scholarly journals. And I'm going to do one more selection, and that's going to be, I'm going to see what the research has been within the last five years. So I'm going to change this start date to 2018. So instead of 8,000, we have 800. And now I am at the point where I start evaluating the articles. Mm -hmm.